Welcome Sagittarius guys. I'm back y'all with another reading. This is going to be a general read guys. So whatever pops out, that's what we're going to talk about. It could be love, money, career, health, wealth, whatever. Whatever comes out, that's what we're going to talk about. All right, so let's see what's going on with the Sagittarius. What messages do we have for the Sagittarius? Give me a message for the Sagittarius. Messages is there for Sagittarius, please. Sun, moon, and rising, please. All right, we're gonna stop it right there. We got the strength card here at the bottom of the deck. Okay, so some of y'all feel like you're rushing something. Some of y'all feel like y'all rushing. Okay, so let's see what's going on. Nine of Pentacles, the Seven of Pentacles, Three of Cups, and the Queen of Cups. Page of Cups and the Three of Wands. Lots of waiting energy here. We got the Knight of Cups. Eight of Cups, the Moon, and the Seven of Wands. Okay. So what I'm seeing here is some of y'all are like waiting until like your finances, like you're in a better financial situation, or like I feel like some of y'all are just like kind of zoomed in and focused on self right now with this Nine of Pentacles energy. Before you could offer anything to anybody else, you're making sure that you and what you got going on is good okay like this is over having fun this is over um <clears throat> this is over having fun having dreams going out hanging out whatever you got responsibilities that you have to take care of before you go out and have fun so there's a lot of waiting energy here like you're getting things in order now, this person that you could be dealing with, they've, they've turned their back and they've walked away. Okay, they've turned their back, they've walked away, or they're emotionally disconnected from this connection. Why is the Eight of Cups here? All right, they walked away, but they'll be back. Okay, maybe they're deciding to give you some time or some space. Um, I feel like this is a connection that you have with someone else. Um... They're just hoping, like, okay, you could have told me the truth. You could have, you know, told me that it's not that big of a deal. Five of Pentacles, Five of Swords. Okay, now we got this Six of Cups. This person walked away. They emotionally uh, left the situation. But their energy, they're still looking back at this. King of Cups could be a water sign. Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. This person is, you know, they're busy. They're working on themselves as well. Um, they have some things that they're looking to, it looks like they're working on their image or something like that. Um, so they're willing to disconnect from this. Um, I'm not sure if you gave this person, you told this person how you felt. Um, but this is what I feel like you guys are focused on yourself right now. Why is the nine of pentacles here? nine of swords yeah it looks like you kind of over you 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 have an anxiety or some type of worry it could have something to do with something going on at home or in a marriage or in a relationship um your intuition is telling you that you may be moving too fast okay you like things are just happening something is happening and it's happening fast 
Yeah, you feel like you need to slow down. See, you you started off strong. We got the Ace of Wands and the Emperor. Like, you started off real, real strong. But then it's like you feel like you're going to regret it or you've had some regrets. So you think that you should just kind of, like, slow things down a bit. Think you should just slow things down a bit. But like I said, do, did you tell this person that? Page of Wands, King of Swords, Ace of Swords. Okay, because it looks like you kind of like just started backing away, you know, pulling back with the Hermit card, kind of like, you know, inching your way out. You feel like this person will get over it. You feel like they're fine. They'll get over it. But you may feel like, okay, well, they, they, they'll get over it. You still, you sit here watching this person. Something don't make sense to you. How is this person keeping up everything? Why is the nine of swords here? Nine cups. Yeah, like right now, you just want to think about yourself. You're putting yourself first, okay? Instead of keep going back and forth, you're kind of like just, you know, thinking about what you have going on first. Now, the three of cups is here. Seven of swords and the three of cups. Ooh, this could involve like a third party. Kind of having some type of regrets here. I see you kind of having some type of regrets. I see you kind of having some type of regrets. Why is the... Why is the Five of Cups here? I'm sorry, the... Yeah, Five of Cups. The King of Pentacles. If something could be something about your money, Okay. It is something about your money. Okay. You can feel like your money's going down the drain. You feel like you need to wait. I'm just getting like you feel like you need to wait. Maybe you want to purchase something, but you're like, mm, maybe I should wait. Why is the seven of pentacles here? Yeah. You could be waiting. You're waiting on a call. Why is this Queen of Cups here? This is about a connection that you have, possibly with the water sign. It's a lot of water here. For some of you, I'm getting child support. Lots of pentacles here. Like, it's a lot about some finances here, money. Um... You're thinking about some like your priorities. You're thinking like, should you start an argument with this person to kind of get them to kind of like push them back so they won't come towards you? Um, I, I feel like you're tired of going back and forth with something. I see you saying like, I don't want to deal with nobody like that. Um, So why is the page of page of cups here? I see 
toxic. This is like a flirting energy. Yeah, I said, I'm getting like you planned on telling this person the truth. Okay, you planned on telling this person the truth about what was going on. See, yeah, see, this person over here felt like you could have just said that. I'm just getting that energy. Like you could have just said that. But in the past, I see you kind of like thinking about what you were going to say to this person or, you know, kind of like give them some type of clarity. But I feel like you held back. You kept, you're kept you keeping it private, you're keeping it a secret. You're not telling what's going on in your home. You're not telling what's going on in your business about your bills and all that. You're not, you're not going to uh, put that information out there. Now, we got the three of wands. Yeah, I'm here and wait until you get paid. Wait until you get situated. Wait until you get everything, all your ducks in a row. intuition is telling you to contact this person reach out to this person but for some reason it's like you just are afraid to you feel like this person is going to want something to ask you for something i feel like you put a lot of effort or work into this um so you I, i'm getting like y'all kind of like owe somebody something or somebody owes you something why is the high priestess here yeah, see, you know, it's saying that you know that with the Five of Swords, it's, it's going to be bad if you reach out to this person. You may think that this person is mad at you. Yeah, look at this. Five of Swords and a Knight of Swords. You you feel you feel like this person is mad at you. So some of y'all Some of y'all are kind of like trying to back out, trying to back out of the situation because Somebody has obligated you to something. Like, you can't just move how you usually move at this time. You're trying to wait until you have everything, all your ducks in a row. Yeah, I'm here, and I can't wait that I get paid again. Can't wait that I get paid again. All right, so the moon is here um, in your hopes and fears. Yeah, you feel like this person to get over it. They'll be back. You feel like, yeah, they'll get over it. They'll be back in due time. And then your outcome is a seven of wands. So, yeah, temperance. You feel like you, it's, you know, you got to stand up for yourself sometimes. Listen, they can be mad, glad. I don't give a damn. <laughs> you just like, look, at this point in time, I got to stand up for myself. Um, I got to do what I need to do for me right now. Um, I feel like you may feel like a connection or a relationship you know, the chapter is closing, but you don't think it's that serious. You don't think it was that serious. Like, but I do see you kind of like dodging this person. Kind of like dodging this person because you just don't want to deal with whatever it is. You just don't want to deal with it. Um, you're kind of like waiting for, um, you're kind of like waiting for, uh, some money to come in. I see you being disappointed. You're kind of like waiting for some money to come in before you make a decision.
this has kind of like slowed you down. You feel like it's something, it's, it's, you just feel like something, for some reason you feel like you gotta slow down on spending. Okay, because we got the Knight of Pentacles and the Page of Pentacles. Like, you got to slow down on on spending because it's like if you don't need it, you don't want to take any type of risk. Yeah, I'm seeing you slowing down. You're slowing down on spending. Yeah, you're seeing firsthand what it can do. Um, so, yeah, you don't want to be, yeah, see, it's too much of a burden. It's too much of a burden. Yeah, that's what I got for y'all. Y'all let me know what's going on in the comment section below. Y'all doing the right thing. If y'all know for a fact that it's time to take a cut back until y'all get all y'all ducks in the bowl, then definitely, by all means, anything that's extra, you got to kind of spread it out to the side and look at what's right in front of you. Get back to all of that later. All right, so y'all let me know what's going on in the comment section below. I'm going to chat with y'all later.